first at 530, probably have your heat on already. And since winter is coming, it'll be working overtime the next couple of months. As those temperatures drop, your bills rise. But there is help if you're struggling to pay them. Digital host Phil Panarski is at the live desk tonight with the options state and local partners discussed. Phil? Emily and Michelle, those organizations include Michigan Health and Human Services, along with DTE Energy, the United Way, and the Heat and Warmth Fund. The state health department says there is currently assistance through the state emergency relief. It's for households at or below 150 percent of the federal poverty level. Effective now, the state is only requiring you to have a past due balance in order to be eligible. You can receive up to $850 for natural gas bills and $1,200 for deliverable fuel and heating sources like propane. But all four groups say they want to help anyone struggling to pay the bills so they can keep warm. This winter. Because of inflation, many customers who were able to pay their bills in the past may have trouble doing so. Many of these people earn an amount higher than the threshold to qualify for financial aid, but we still want these customers to reach out to us. And the Heat and Warmth Fund, or THAW for short, said you can always reach out to them and they will try to help meet your needs this winter. The United Way and DTE also encourage you to reach out for any assistance needed. At the live desk tonight, Phil Panarski, News 8.